It's time once again for the big Colonial Club Strawberry Fest occurring on this Saturday. And joining us now, Bob Powers from Colonial Club to tell us a little bit more about it. Good morning to you. Good morning, Amy. And this has been around for 24 years. 24 years ago, a group of seniors in Sun Prairie thought, hey, let's put on a strawberry festival. And lo and behold, here we are, 24 years later. And you in, are including so many events all of this in one day from 8 until 3 today. 8 till 3. And tell us what some of the events Gosh. are. Well, the first thing is uh, at 8 o'clock we kick off our 5K, 10K run walk. Mm -hmm. And uh, we had 340 participants last year. We're on track to have that same number this year. Wow. Um, so that, that begins. And then at 8, also all the really activities, the crafter booths open, mm -hmm. breakfast opens. We have strawberry waffles oh, uh, for yum. breakfast. Um, the uh, all the craft booths both the inside and out. The flea market too you have? We have a flea market that will be going on. Lots of uh, treasures you'll find there. Uh, we have a inflatable city for the young folks and so I guess it's just I, w I haven't seen it it's just set mm -hmm. up several different sorts of castles or something to jump around in. Um, from there we've got entertainment. We've got somebody coming out and going to lead a Zumba group uh, oh, outside fun. on the entertainment stage. We've got a couple of different bands. Um, Gemini Entertainment and Tech Noir, which is an 80s cover mm -hmm. band, so all you 80s freaks come on out for that. <laughs> and this is open to the entire community. Anybody can yeah, come. Yeah, obviously. We want everybody to come. It's There's a lot of stuff going on on the east end of Sun Prairie. Mm -hmm. There's a Cannery Block Square party that day as well. It's just across the street from us. Uh, so there's there's a good excuse to come down. Easy to get to. You can park at the New Sun Prairie High School in the south lot and the Barry bus will be shuttling people back and, and forth. And that's a perfect idea yeah, to get people. Yeah. Now, you have a local connection too with the strawberries. Right. You know, we're obviously a local organization mm -hmm. and, and we get so much support from our local businesses. But also we try to promote the fact that we're supporting local business as well. The strawberries that we'll be selling are from uh, Kirschbaum's and Beaver Dam. Mm -hmm. We've got some great wine. We're going to have a wine tasting and we have some strawberry, strawberry wine, wine. Yeah. from Three Lakes, Wisconsin. So w we do what we can to support local business as well as we're asking local people, people to, support. to support a local sure. organization helping seniors. Now you're offering strawberry shortcakes in the afternoon. You mentioned the strawberry waffles. Uh, strawberry floats, strawberry sundaes. Some wow. people don't want the cake. They just want the berries and the cream, whatever. And so you can just oh. buy the local strawberries there too you and can. go home and make your own treats. We've got quarts of strawberries for sale. Last year we sold a thousand quarts of strawberries. Oh Every single one that we ordered we sold. Wow. So um, um, ice cream as well. I got to mention, you know, we've got the great support of Sheps and Sassy Cow mm -hmm. Creameries doing the ice cream for us. So, so strawberry ice cream too? Stra well, strawberry sundaes. Okay, okay. Well, a wonderful idea. So well established. Yeah. All at the Colonial Club in Sun Prairie. All of this taking place, of course, today from 8 a.m. till 3 p.m. A number of activities for all members of the family. Have a wonderful time. It Thanks. sounds like a great time. Thanks so much. And thank you, Bob.